One of my personal gripes with like the education system is that they don't really teach people, you know, the difference between owning and running a home, you know, how to leverage credit and really even just how to do basic accounting in their life. And those are all things that I think could be implemented and changed within the education system, as well as using the things like AI, where there's people learn in different ways. Some people are visual learners, some people are audio learners. And if you could cater and like enhance teachers, you know, already like they're they're already teaching, but you can enhance their capabilities by you know teaching individuals how they want to be teached. It could it could explode, you know. Yeah. It, 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 it could, Sorry, I had to. That was a teaching no, moment. You're, you're great. Yeah. It could uh, it could it could boom, like the education system could boom, and I think America could go to that next level. Yeah. So, but would you also agree that maybe not everyone should go the tra college traditional route? Route. Yeah, that's a tough one. Let me let me give you an analogy. Um, when I was in high school, I worked for McDonald's, as I mentioned. They offered to send me to Hamburger U. It was very tempting. It was going to come with a big salary increase, and they were going to teach me everything I needed to know to be in the hamburger business. Well, yeah, but think about that. And instead, I said no. I said thank you for the opportunity, and I went to a traditional four-year college. And in that four-year college, I learned man, there's all kinds of other stuff I can do. I don't have to be flipping burgers for the rest of my life or even managing a McDonald's. I can do anything I want to do. Man, maybe I, want to, maybe I want to be a business person. Maybe I want to be a lawyer, so I went on to graduate school. And uh, then graduate school even opened my eyes further. Had I stayed in that McDonald's vertical, hamburger you, I would have made all, more money than I ever thought I'd make in my life. I would not. I don't think, unless I ended up being chairman of McDonald's, odds aren't very good of that. Um, I probably, um, you know, would be struggling a little bit today had I stayed in that vertical. So that's the trap, and that's what I worry about today. I've seen this trap, and I've seen people get stuck in this trap of thinking, well, look at these great jobs. I can make 150 bucks an hour doing this or that. Right now, airline pilots. You can go through and learn, learn to fly without a college degree, and you can make 100, 150,000 bucks a year. Would you rather be the pilot up front, or would you rather own that airplane and have somebody else flying you? Would you rather be the pilot, or would you rather be on a commercial flight going to some exotic location somewhere in the world? And that's the difference, because education gives you the option, it gives you the flexibility to do anything you want. So let me answer this specific question. Should everybody go to college? No, it's not for everybody. Should everybody have the chance to go to college and to be the best they can be and to get as much freedom? Because it's not about money. It's about freedom, I promise you. Yes, everyone should at least have the opportunity to learn as much as they can and have as much college as they can or graduate school. And then is always the opportunity to default to I'll go take this job or this career or even this vocation, which is fine. 